Deuteronomy 8, verse 18. But thou shalt remember the Lord thy God, for it is he that gives thee power to get wealth. That's right. You shall remember the Lord your God, for it is he that gives who? Power. Me. You power. power to get wealth. Does it say he gives you the wealth? No, no. he gives me the power to get wealth. He gives it. me the power. So if you, if you were to continue to pray all the time, God give me wealth, God give me money, would your prayers be correct? No. no. Or would they be, be out of line with scripture? Yeah. God, I need some money. God, give me some money. Is he going to? No. He, he really doesn't even have any to give you, does he? Is he going to manufacture it out of heaven and send it down? No. He's going to give you power that gets it. We've been down this road. We went down this road last week a little bit and the week before. Are you here? Yes. Does this make sense? Mm -hmm. So what's going to, is God going to give you wealth? No. No, he's going to give you power to get it. Yeah. God gives you the power to get wealth. He gives who the power to get wealth? Me. Say me. Me. Who's he going to give it to? Me. You're telling me that God's going to give you yes. the power to get the wealth. Yeah. So he's not going to do something out here with the wealth, is he? No. Really? So no, he's going to give you the, the power, power that does it. something that yeah. gets the wealth. Right? Yeah. Hallelujah. And you kind of have to jump through these hurdles because people have their mind on the wrong thing. They're looking in the wrong area. I need some more money. No, you don't. You need some more, more power, power that gets the money. That's right. That's right. I need the power. Is that right? Yes. Yep. God, give me some more money. Oh, be quiet. You're praying wrong. <laughs> need the power. Mm. Yep. Not forever. Acts chapter 1, verse 8. But you shall receive power. what? Power. 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 So we have God saying that he doesn't give the wealth. He gives power to get wealth. And then he says, you shall receive power. Power when? After. After that the Holy Ghost has come on you. That's right. So how, somehow the Holy Ghost and power are is, is God's way to get wealth to you. Mm -hmm. It's come on you. So now let's go over and see what happened after the Holy mm -hmm. Ghost came on them. Because they're going to receive power after. after the Holy Ghost came on them. Acts chapter 2, verse 1. And when the day of Pentecost was fully come, they were all with one accord in one place, and suddenly there came a sound from heaven as a rushing mighty wind, and it filled all the house where they were sitting. How did the Holy Ghost come? A in a sound. sound. And there appeared unto them cloven tongues as of fire, and it sat upon two of them, and the rest oh, stared at them. Each. It sat on each of them. Yeah. Love it. Right? Yeah. Yes. Each of them. Yeah, but it's different for me. That's your problem. Okay, no, it. it's not. You need to receive the Holy Ghost the way everybody receives the Holy Ghost. Right. And if you haven't received the Holy Ghost this way, then you haven't received the Holy Ghost. Mm. You've missed it somehow. Mm. Is this right? Yes. Yeah. Okay. And they were all filled with the Holy Ghost. Woo! Yay. And began. Be they began to speak. With other tongues as the Spirit came, gave them utterance. So what happened after? They began to speak. They, spoke. they received the Holy Ghost. Yeah, they began what happened speak. after? They began, began to speak. speak. They twitched? They began no. to speak. No, they began, they began to speak. Right. Well, he said you're going to receive power after you receive the Holy Ghost, after he comes on you. Well, what came on them, what happened after he came on them was they began to speak. Yes. And obviously, this is the whole message. I can preach this till you know, the sun goes down and comes up again. Yay. But I don't need to. You understand that. Mm -hmm. So the power is in speaking mm -hmm. right. in other tongues. Yay. The power to get wealth yes. is in speaking Speak, with other right. tongues. Right. Are you telling me that when I speak in other tongues, I'm speaking the power to get yes. wealth? Yes. Oh, okay. And if you don't, guess how much wealth is coming to you? Nothing. Nothing. Yep. In fact, to the degree, and this is what God's been, I'm, well, I'm going to try to get out some stuff today, to the degree that you want the things of God in your life is the degree you have to match that with your tongues and your fervency in speaking with other tongues and your diligence and your faithfulness in speaking with other tongues. Mm.
your guy.